Kent puts the gun in his mouth. Soon, Kent comes back to life. He puts on this clown suit and he can't take it off. Now the clown suit is part of his body. His eyeballs becomes grotesque, and his teeth becomes sharp. Kent decides to hide in the garage so as not to be discovered. But his clown look still attracts a child. The boy brings Kent food. Kent doesn't dare open the door. Because he's turned into a child-eating monster. To stop hurting the child, Kent decides to kill himself. He starts the chainsaw. He prepares to lie down and be sliced open by it. Kent hesitates for a long time. Suddenly, the boy bursts into the garage. Kent is so shocked that he falls. The chainsaw goes out of control and flies into the boy. The boy is dead. Kent touches the boy's blood. He lapped it up. Kent is devastated after eating the little boy. He tells his wife the truth. The wife thinks that he has done nothing wrong. So she goes to the garage and takes Kent home. To keep Kent from committing further murders, the wife chains him up. Kent's son is bullied by his classmates at school.